boxing fans, we've got a heavyweight contest coming to you from here at Tingley Coliseum in Albuquerque, New Mexico. As we look up at ring announcer Thomas Triber waiting for his cue, it will be Aaron Conway taking on Tom Martin in a heavyweight bout set for four rounds. And we're just about ready as uh, the ring announcer is waiting for his cue. Pretty good crowd on hand for this one. We look up into the corner of Tom Martin from Orlando, Florida. His opponent will be Aaron Conway from Hutchinson, Kansas. And here we go. Introducing to you first, to my right of the right corner. And he's wearing the black trunks with the white trim and weighing at 221 pounds. And from Hutchinson, Kansas, he has a professional record of one win with three losses, one coming by way of knockout. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Aaron Conway. And his opponent fighting directly across from him out of the blue corner. He's wearing the green trunks with the black trim and weighted at 246 pounds. Hailing from Miami, Florida, he is undefeated with three wins, no losses. Two of those wins coming by Joe Nakia. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Tommy Morton. Once again, here's your referee, Joe Hidalgo, now to give the instructions. They want to hold it in the head. Good luck to both of them. Okay, so referee Joe Hidalgo gives his instructions to the two fighters. We are just about ready to get underway with this one. Scheduled for four in the heavyweight division. Florida's Tom Martin traveling here to New Mexico to take on Aaron Conway from Hutchinson, Kansas. And this should be an interesting one for sure. A good test for Tom Martin in the green trunks. You're watching the eight count boxing hour on community cable channel 27 here in Albuquerque. Dan Cisneros at ringside bringing you the boxing action of the Duke City. You will see that Aaron Conway is a southpaw coming out to take on uh, Tom Martin. Martin is a highly celebrated amateur out of Florida and they're expecting big things from him. He comes in at three and oh and he would certainly be the favorite in this one. As you see, Conway not shy about stepping in and, and letting some shots fly. You'll see Tom Martin work behind the jab. Good stand-up boxing style from Martin. Work on it. Work it. Nice crowd on hand here at Albuquerque's Tingley Coliseum. Gotta be first, Tommy. Be first. That's it. Walking down. Walking down. Walking with it, walking with it. Go far, Be first, Tom, come on. There you go, bring the hook, let's go, do it. Just throw him, just throw him, Tom, it's right there. That's it, come on, come on. Gotta win the round. Go too wide. Hard to the body, Tom, jump back on it. Bring the elbows in. See Tom Martin. Martin working as the counter That's puncher, it. waiting for Conway to move in on him. Conway working behind hard, that jab, coming in with a southpaw shot. style. Yeah, we'll see if that gives Martin anything to worry about. Just Tommy, underway in the up. first round here. Snap the jab. That's it. Underneath, underneath, underneath. There you see Martin missing with some rib. shots, not really loading up, just rib, looking Tommy. to see to what will work against his Throw opponent, hard, Aaron Conway. Conway in the black trunks picked up his first victory in his last fight. That was a second round technical knockout win over Nate Walenta. And that fight taking place in Lincoln, Nebraska. So he got on the board with his first win, coming in here with a little bit of momentum against the undefeated Tom Martin in the green trunks. Let's go. Combination. Keep you down in the body, Tommy. Come on. Tommy, wait too long. Martin's last fight was a four round decision win over Charles Q. Tommy, throw the hands. And he moved you up to 3-0. Hook the body now, Tom. Work it. The body, Tom. The body. Martin missing with that counter right hand. Work. That's it. That's it. He's ready to go. Conway lands a nice little right hand to the body of Tom Martin. Ten seconds down. Tommy, hit with power and speed. Come on. The call for 10 seconds. 
kind of a feeling out opening round. Neither guy launching anything heavy here. There you see Martin try to go to the body right at the bell and that ends the first round. As we look into the corner of Tom Martin, originally from Orlando, Florida, now fighting out of Miami. And we look over into the corner of Aaron Conway, the heavyweight out of Hutchinson, Kansas. Thanks again for joining us tonight here on the Eight Count Boxing Hour. We're glad to bring you this undercard bout from this big show here at Tingley Coliseum. Eric Morell will be appearing after this fight. And uh, Floyd Mayweather, an up and coming young fighter from Michigan, and he was uh, an outstanding amateur star. And uh, he'll be appearing here tonight on this card also. He's a guy we've got our eye on. We hear some good things about him, of course, following him as an amateur. An outstanding uh, boxer with a lot of promise. He'll be taking on Reggie Sanders, but that's later on. That'll be the second fight of Floyd Mayweather. Uh, Floyd Mayweather Jr. Round two underway. You're watching the eight count boxing hour. Aaron Conway and Tom Martin in the heavyweight division. Tommy, walk him down. Pay attention. Go to the ear. Let's go. Walk him down. Tom Martin has not been very busy in this one. It's been Conway that's kind of pressing the action. That could serve him well. There's a counter shot, but it was caught on the gloves by Conway, and Conway jumps in with a left hand now. Catches Tom Martin. Only four rounds to work with, so Tommy Martin should start to get busy here. Trying to keep that record undefeated. He steps into the ring here at 3-0. The referee is Joe Hidalgo in this one. There's a right hand that lands for Martin, and now he tries to step in and dig to the body, but Conway fires back. Conway just missing with a right hand now. And a warning goes to Tom Martin for Getting a little bit below the belt line there. Again, you see Martin trying to go with that right hand to the body. Tighten up the point arm. Tighten them up. One, two, one, Tommy. One, two, one. Put it right in the chin. Let's go, Tommy. Throw it. Martin usually fires pretty straight shots. He's been a little bit working out from the outside here and uh, swinging a little bit wide with his shots. Pick it up. Take the round. Maybe the southpaw stance of Conway throwing Martin off just a little bit. Tom Martin was an excellent amateur, though. He has a lot of experience, so he should be able to work around that. As you see, Martin just kind of smothering Conway on the inside there, and referee Hidalgo breaks the two. Let's go, work, Tom. Yes, put some behind it. Put some behind it. Again, Martin missing, just seeming to be a little bit a, a hair off. Meanwhile, Conway continues to work with both hands. Not a good start for Tom Martin. It may take him a little while to warm up. It's very cold here in the, in the arena here in Tingley Coliseum. And the two are just kind of tangled up here with a few seconds left in the round. There's the bell to end the second round. Not a whole lot to choose from in that second round. corner of Aaron Conway is pretty happy with the way things are progressing right now. Uh, the favorite Tom Martin has not been able to hurt Conway in any way, and actually it's been Aaron Conway that's been pressing the action here, and just by staying busy and, and Martin's lack of activity, Aaron Conway is in this one. We're halfway through this one as we get ready for round three, scheduled for four. 
Aaron Conway and Tom Martin from Tingley Coliseum here in Albuquerque, New Mexico. Conway being aggressive and Martin trying to stay out of harm's way. You can hear Tom Martin's corner. Uh, they're just sitting off to the right of me here. And they want him to get busy and step in a little bit. He gets caught with a jab right there and Martin is just having trouble finding Conway. That's it, work hard now, work hard. Three at least each time. Work it, work it, work it, Tommy. Tommy, back him up, short upper cut, short right hand, come on. Again, it's Conway pressing forward, Martin giving ground. Over, Tommy. It gives go. the judges the impression get those miss up and get of, uh, Get him up, get him up. Now work. That's, get shooting. Underneath, underneath, Go underneath, there. Tommy, underneath. Of aggression work by underneath. Aaron hard. Conway. Hard underneath, Tommy. Right there, cool. Now you Tommy, see. Martin start to stand his ground a little bit and fire him back, but he's missing. Having trouble connecting on Aaron Conway. There's a little body shot that gets in there and Conway answers right back. The effective aggressiveness definitely going to uh, Aaron Conway in this one, surprisingly. Keep your hands free. Tommy, you gotta take this round, let's go, work hard. Yes, come back with it. Work on the knee, Tommy. Snap it. Both guys coming off wins here. You see Martin now trying to work to the body. Again, he gets a warning for a low blow. And he, but he comes right back with a body shot. Tommy, let your hands go. And Joe Hidalgo tells him, you've got your second warning. So Martin's going to have to be careful with those low shots. He can't, surely cannot afford to lose a point here. Come on, Sam. Put them together. Come back with that hook every time. Work him hard, Tommy. Good shot. Good shot. Good body shot. Get on, Again, the warning goes to Tom Martin. Tommy, get on him. That's a good body shot, bro. Oh, that's a good body shot. And that's going to be a one-point deduction against Tom Martin for low blows. Joe Hidalgo has seen enough of that. He's asked repeatedly. And Martin continues to go a little bit south of the border there. And that is a very costly point deduction here in this four-rounder. Now you see Martin, though, he's not going to stop going to the body. He works, lands a few shots, but he did get countered with a left hand there by Conway. So Tom Martin really digging himself a hole to climb out of here and not a whole lot of time to do something about it as that ends the third round of four. Concern in the corner of undefeated Tom Martin. of these guys are coming off of wins. Uh, Conway scoring a technical knockout in his last fight and, and it was Tom Martin winning a, a four round decision. And right now everything's looking like it's going Aaron Conway's way. One round to go in this one. Call for seconds out. We're going to the final round of this one, scheduled for four. And with the point deduction, Tom Martin's corner very concerned about their fighter. Here we go. They touch him up, and we go into the fourth and final round. That's it. Work. Come on. Not stop, Tommy. Keep your hands in. Do it. Come on, Tommy Martin. Stick it in his face, Tom. Shoot it out there. Do it again. I'm going to keep the combinations coming. Good. Martin started things off working, but then Conway just got inside and let him fly. And now Conway working from the outside. There's some body shots now from Tom Martin, who starts to warm up a little bit here. Use the jab now, Tommy. Use the jab. Shut the right hand up. Tommy, shut the right hand up with the jab. That's it. Bring the combination after it. 
Oh, and there's a right hand that scores from Martin. That got Conway's attention. Conway kind of moving forward. I think he was a little buzzed by that one. As he just kind of falls in and, and tries to stop the attack of Tom Martin. Now Martin just kind of hanging on. The two get tangled up there. Push it, Tommy, push! Push! Step away from the guy and push! Step back, Tommy! Work from out there! You can hear Martin's cornermen asking them to step back, get a little space to land those big straight shots. Step back, work from outside. Get those hands up and shoot. Tommy, you're shooting too high. Conway doing a good job of crowding Martin. Step back, Tommy. Don't let him try your hand. Tommy, don't let him try you work. Stay outside. Work the uppercut. Tommy, uppercut. That's it. There's an uppercut from Tom Martin, just like his corner man Tommy, was asking for. Uppercut. The crowd just kind of filing in, so it's kind of quiet here, and uh, Martin can certainly hear his corner man instruct, giving him instructions. Elbow shoot, Tommy! Step back, Tommy, step back! And now Tommy, you see Martin just kind of pushing on shoot, Conway Tommy, as he had him back against the ropes. The outside, a better round for Tom Martin here, Tommy, you're leaning in on him. but he got off to a slow start in that one God point it, reduction Tommy. for the low blows. Tommy and Quinches, Could come into play Tommy, in this one. Suck it up! Punch, Tom. Yeah. Tommy, you got to throw punches. Punch. Speed, Tommy, speed. Work the uppercut, Tommy. Shorten him up. Neither guy, Neither guy looking very fast-handed here. It's kind of a lethargic performance by up, both Tom. fighters, but Conway has continued one, to, with that right same pattern up, of moving up, in, up. staying close and working. Tommy, Tommy. Martin has landed a few good shots, but he has just not been real busy. Time running out in this one. And that will do it. This bout goes the full four rounds. And wow, could this be the first loss for Tom Martin? Aaron Conway doing just enough to win the early rounds. Gets the point deduction for the low blows. And we'll see what the judges come up with in this one. This should be an interesting decision from the three judges here in Albuquerque. A lot of concern in the corner of Tom Martin. You can see pretty quiet over here on this side. I would just love to hear what they're saying over in Conway's corner right now. They've got to feel pretty good, but Tom Martin is the fighter with the big name, so we'll see what the judges come up with. And we will go to ring announcer Thomas Triber and find out who got this one. Mike Sanchez scores about 39 to 38. And Judge Joel Cruz scores about 40 to 37. All in favor of your winner by unanimous decision, Aaron Conway. So Aaron Conway comes in and pulls off the upset. Unanimous decision. The judges got it right. And congratulations to Aaron Conway. Thanks for joining us, everyone, here on the 8-Count Boxing Hour.